It's like the lash kit set. Your girl did not tear up. <laughs> so yeah, try that. Okay, so I kind of wish this had a pump. This looks so, so delicious. She'll do it, some funny stuff on the low. Yeah, you gotta catch her. Cause this camera is the GOAT. Okay, y'all cannot see me. Welcome back to another vlog. So I got a new vlog tripod. <laughs> I'm over here trying to, okay, trying to understand it. Wait, sorry guys. Oh, okay, I have to twist the thing. It is officially fall season, so I was like, you know what, let me go ahead and vlog for you guys an evening routine. Um, it is about to be, oh, actually it's seven o'clock. This is a really late video, by the way. I normally do not, start filming this late. I think for dinner today, I'm gonna do um, pasta. I have been watching TikTok. I've been on TikTok a little too much, but I seen like this pasta recipe. Um, I'm just gonna like recreate it, but give it my own twist. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Jane stopped over at Trader Joe's and grabbed a few things. So the first thing that she got, spinach. I was debating whether to do spinach or broccolini. So I settled on spinach. You guys, I'll be honest, this house barely, and I mean barely has juice. We don't do it on purpose. We just have water and we just be drinking a lot of water. So I also had her grab the organic strawberry lemonade. Let me know if you guys have tried this from Trader Joe's. It looks really good. Like seriously, if you go to Trader Joe's and haven't tried their spiced cider, you're missing out. A sausage, pasta, and then I also had her grab um, this Italian hot pepper sauce and I seen this girl she mixed this in her pasta as well so I'm gonna and this one has chili pepper this looks really really good and, I, and then I'm also gonna add tomato paste and then last but not least Parmesan cheese so this is not like a crazy haul obviously because it's something that I want to cook tonight like right now um, so yeah it's really late but you know what I don't care we're just gonna keep going with it okay like right now you guys I would be done with dinner, like it would have been done, cooked, ready to be eaten, but it's it's like it is what it is. Well, I'm gonna drizzle a little bit of olive oil. Extra virgin olive oil. And this is how it looks. Now, normally this is not how I cook my pasta. By the way, I just put water and salt and oil and I let it boil and then I go ahead and put in my pasta. But today is a different day. I just put in everything all at once. So while the pasta is boiling, I made sure I put it low so then it doesn't burn. But I figured I'd just get a little bit of editing done. I filmed a Fashion Nova haul for you guys, but on Instagram. I haven't really done a Fashion Nova video for you guys in a long time, I feel like. I think the last one, I have to go check. The last Fashion Nova video, it, it's probably been like two, three months. <gasps> it's been five months? Yo, that that's crazy. I'm over here like looking like, am I tripping? But I wanna do a couple for like the fall season, just like pieces that I think are really cute um, for the fall and winter season because girl, the weather is changing. Let me show you guys how um, amazing the quality is. Well, the number one question I always get asked in my DMs is what camera do I use, what lens? I wanna show you guys, um, and I'm gonna link the camera for you guys down in the description box. And I also edit all my videos with Final Cut Pro, but I wanna just kinda show you guys. This lens is amazing, but the only thing I dislike about this lens is how blurry, blurry it gets like it takes a minute for it to focus on you okay that's actually not too bad can you guys see that like it is just this camera is the goat when it comes to quality it is but i just have to figure out why um no matter what lens i use it's giving me a hard time you guys follow me on instagram because i know some of you guys don't have an instagram which is fine i feel like you don't you don't need an instagram I don't like if you really don't care for Instagram you don't need one but if you do have an Instagram and you follow me on there 
um, I really do enjoy good quality content because I just feel like I mean it just does it for me so I try to invest in like really high-end good lens or good cameras I don't spend my money on like luxury bags but guess what honey I'm gonna spend my coins on good quality cameras or lens okay that's just like my luxury for example mm, 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 mm. Okay. oh my gosh I like the texture of this mm. that's soft already okay that cooked really fast I'm gonna go ahead and wash up my spinach um so this is not this is not just spinach by the way it has um baby spinach baby collard greens and so much other greens in here but first i gotta wash it up oh jane you scared me the head one minute you're sitting the next minute you're Oh my gosh, you guys might wonder, how is it living with your younger sister? Listen, she's a clown. Party every day. Yeah, Jane is so funny. She is really hilarious. And we're always asking ourselves, like, where did she get her little comedian in her? And it's my mom. My mom is hilarious. Bro, when you get mama in here, oh my. we die. We're just clowning on each other as a family, as I feel like everybody should be clowning each other. <laughs> but like, yeah, I feel like, I feel like we, we get it from mom. Mm -hmm. But then like, Maggie, you gotta catch Maggie because she'll, she'll do some funny stuff on the low. Yeah. You gotta catch her. You really do. Me, I be bold with it. Yeah. Esther, she be bold with it too. <laughs> <laughs> and all the greens uh, pretty well. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it off one more time, but this time around with like cold water. Okay, so I've seen this, um, is it TikTok or in this Instagram video? I think it was an Instagram, in can I not talk, what? I think it was an Instagram video. And the person said, if you wanna stop crying when you cut an onion, just don't cut the end, okay? You can cut the front, because you know when they're together, I feel like this is the front, and then don't cut the back. Um, yeah, that's gonna help for you not to cry. And I thought it was like a lie, but girl, it's not. Because <laughs> every time I cut my onion like that, I make sure I leave the end on, and then I go ahead and just cut her up. Just like that, and your girl did not tear up. <laughs> so yeah, try that. We're gonna let this pan get a little bit hot, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put in my onions. And while the onions is cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and cut up um, the sausage. This looks so, so delicious. So all the seasonings, I did garlic powder, onion powder, and then I did this other uh, one that I recently got at Saraga's. A little bit of white pepper, and I also did Italian seasoning, I did that. And what else? I added just a dash of this right here. Just a dash, not too much. 
And I think that was it. Yeah, I think that's pretty much all the seasoning that I use. Okay, my room is not that bad. I filmed in my bedroom and every time I film, I just have clothes all over. Let me show you guys. Like just clothes everywhere, but today's not that bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and pick up after myself. The purse is away, but I wanna take this makeup off and I'm like, this is the perfect time to, geez, it's so dark. This is like the perfect time to share with you guys like my nighttime skincare routine. I am now getting so sleepy. I recently like ordered, I think it was like a three pack or a four pack, like these little black. I feel like black is the safest route to go if you're going to um, purchase your um, headbands because white gets dirty, then you have to wash them. Then black, it still gets dirty, but like at least you don't see it. <laughs> And you can use it a couple times until you wash it. So, yeah. And then, you guys, I love my vanity facial steamer. If you want to have that spa treatment but at home, this is what you need to invest in. I used to have one from Amazon. It was cool, but this one is so much better. And um, the, the quality beats the one from Amazon that I had, I feel like. I been loving I'm pretty sure I shared this with you guys last time on one of my vlogs if not I really don't remember the last time I did like a skincare routine with y'all so this Elemis uh, pro collagen cleansing balm is amazing I think this is my third or second purchase love this stuff it's amazing but today honestly I want to give this Mac cleansing oil a try okay so I kind of wish this had a pump or did I lose the pump? Because there's no way in heck they will come out with a cleansing balm like that without a pump. But yeah, girl, I do not use makeup wipes no more. Y'all have been watching me for a while. You know, I used to use like Neutrogena makeup wipes. Those like were the goat. But once I figured out that cleansing balm is the way to go, it just takes off the makeup, it breaks all the dirt, it really changes the game and your skin thanks to you. I got like a whole pack of these like compressed um, facial cleansers and they also are perfect for exfoliating. So they look like this, but then once I get it wet, they get a little bit bigger. And then this is what I've been using to like take the oil out of my face. But I love this stuff, especially if you have lashes and you don't want to get your lashes wet right away. These are amazing. So for cleanser, I'm gonna use the Tatcha Rice Water Cleanser. And then I'm also gonna go ahead and turn on my steamer. So yeah, I take advantage of my steamer because I really wanna get deeper into my pores and my facial steamer is just gonna open up my pores so we can really tackle down any dirt. You don't wanna look directly at it because it's gonna feel like it's gonna burn your skin, but this is like perfect to just open it up. So I'm gonna go ahead and like cleanse for at least 60 seconds. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean my lashes with this eyelash shampoo and I just got it from Amazon. Lashes are clean. I got this whole set from Amazon. It's like the lash kit set. It comes with the fan, the lash shampoo, like the lash brush and the lash spoolie and then like this like nice bottle to clean your lashes, you know? I feel like this, this kit is perfect for beginner friendly lash tags, but girl, I need it for us too. For the people who have the lashes and need to clean it. So I decided let me just go ahead and get the set. I'm gonna go ahead and just mist my skin with this rose water spray from uh, Grace's Tella. So next stop is gonna be my Essence Toner. I use these two. I normally tone at least like six times, but I use these two together. And I don't wait for my skin to get dry. So I'm gonna start with the light, lightest toner here. 
and also I'm gonna have everything down in the description box in case I did not I'm pretty sure some of you guys have seen this already my skincare routine but in case you haven't here it is so I apply this all over tap 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 and I make sure I apply it like three times so I'm gonna go in with this toner and again just gonna go ahead and tap this into the skin. This is my skincare routine now. And honestly, I love it. I love it. I stopped using the benzoyl peroxide. You know from acne.org, I'm thinking what it is. It's literally just benzoyl peroxide. I stopped using it um, because I used to use it so much, but I obviously stopped using it for a very long time. But I feel like now I'm really never gonna go back to it because now since I do my skincare like this, I am set. So the next product is this girl that we all have seen. She is talked about. She's very popular and I see the reason why. At first I wasn't about this life. Honestly, I really wasn't. And I was like, I'm not about to get this snail mucus and stuff. That's disgusting. Um, and then I just kept seeing it everywhere on TikTok and I'm like, okay, enough. I finally got it and I actually did not order it. I ended up getting it at TJ Maxx and I have been hooked. I see why it's a good product. I see why, like I understand, okay? But it is very slimy. I've used like two bottles of this and this is gonna be my third bottle once I'm done with this one. Let me check out the next two, honey. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my hyaluronic acid. This is the only step that's a little bit different than my morning routine. In the mornings, I apply my vitamin C. <laughs> and then in the um, evening, nighttime, I apply my hyaluronic acid. But this hyaluronic acid, you guys, it is probably the best hyaluronic acid, hyaluronic acid that I've used on my skin. It's literally the best. And this is my second purchase. I'm gonna be going on my third purchase on this. So, so, listen, so much. So I'm gonna also apply my eye cream. I need to get a better eye cream. Like I'm testing out this one. Like, is it really doing anything different? I don't know. Done with all skincare. Last but not least is my moisturizer. And for that, I think I'm gonna do this one. And this is the acne.org moisturizer. I don't use the benzoyl peroxide, but I use their moisturizer still because it's in my little travel size. Um, and it's always here. I don't know why I don't have like another moisturizer, but this moisturizer is good. Perfect for sensitive skin. I am so sorry, y'all. <laughs> the camera went dead when I was doing my skincare routine, but yeah, pretty much, this is my skincare routine, looking like a glazed donut. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and put me a junior dinner. Jane has already eaten, so it's just me and babe. Um, I think we're just gonna do like bowls. If you love apple cider, you need to try the one from Trader Joe's. It's really Look, good. Never mind. I'll get that. It's sour, man. Damn, it Ooh, that's a lot. If it's sour, that's a lot. Oh, again, strawberry and lemonade. Ooh. Man, that shook my soul. I mean, it's not like. That shit, my soul. It's not terrible, but it is pretty sour. <laughs> Ooh, that's sour compared to this. Okay, yeah, well, Man, this let's go ahead. Is growing and eating, Do you want me to shave your head tomorrow? Yeah, pretty good. I need to do that shit here. Cool. Junior's hair grows so fast. Like, although he's like. I don't even have no hair, yeah. but it grows so fast. Like, he I hardly don't... has hair, but he has hair. You know what I'm saying? My bull head is. Like he lost hair in certain areas, but like he still has hair. That although he wants to be like uh, completely bald, it grows within a week, you still see hair. I'm just like, what the heck? If you watch, I think the recent vlog, we took um, Babe to, oh it's itchy. We took him to get his um, hair shaved and within less than a week, it grew back. <laughs> 
was like, what the heck? How does it feel? This right here, guys, smells amazing. I will be honest, it doesn't throw. It doesn't have a strong throw at all. So, that's like the only thing I don't really like about it. So, yeah. I'm gonna have to have my sister make me a candle because she makes candles. Oh, Lord. Lord, I almost burned my finger. So, normally, you guys, I... Uh, make myself a cup of tea But because I'm drinking The apple cider I'm not gonna drink tea because that's way too much liquid before I go to bed still love these throw-on blankets from um, Target literally the best the best throw-on blanket. I love it. It's so comfortable and cozy I have the other one right here I just be like literally covering myself. They're so nice and they just go so well with the decor and the couch and it just looks so nice. I feel like Netflix is not Netflixing anymore. Like they do come out with really good movies, but nowadays I'm like, I- no, no, Not a movie that you're expecting or you want to watch. Yeah. No, you got me on this, right? Is it you? Yeah, you started watching it and then you never really Yeah, it's, it's like you gotta have time to see that watching it. That's why I don't like shows TV like shows. Yeah. Because it's like if I don't have time have to, to have always time keep up it, with yeah. it, yeah, I always forget. And Cause I, you start, you start, then it's like you stop. Yeah. You watch it again. And then you start a new one again. And you start something new. Yeah, that's why for me TV shows, you just, I mean, it has to be the best. Like How to Get Away with Murder was a good TV show. And at least, and man, we watched that was so long, but we used to stay up and watch that, man. Mm -hmm.